We turn now to the head of the Spanish Soccer Federation suspended this morning. The latest fallout after he kissed a player on the lips after Spain won the Women's World Cup last week. Ariel Reshef is here with that. Good morning, Ariel. Good morning to you, Rebecca. So many in the sports world talking about this. The uproar marring what should have been a week of celebration for Spain's national team. Just eight days ago, they were sitting on top of the sports world after their historic win. Now several key coaches and players are refusing to work, calling on FIFA to out. Luis Rubiales. This morning, Spain's soccer chief suspended for 90 days over this moment on women's soccer's most prestigious stage. Luis Rubiales kissing Spain's star Jenny Hermoso on the lips after her team's World Cup victory, an act she says was unwanted and immediately sparked widespread calls for his resignation. No te vas. Rubiales defiant, refusing to step down. No voy a dimitir. Saying repeatedly, no, I'm not dimitir. going to resign. Spain's soccer federation standing by its embattled chief, even threatening legal action against Hermoso, accusing her of lying over the incident. Spain wins the World Cup. But now, nearly all of Spain's World Cup winning coaches and players resigning or refusing to play until Rubiales is gone. Many in the soccer world coming together to support Hermoso. Players from Spanish men's club Cadiz displaying a banner saying in Spanish, we are all with Jenny. And American soccer star Alex Morgan posting on social media, I'm disgusted by the public actions of Luis Rubiales. I stand by Jenny Hermoso and the Spanish players. The controversy stirring up long-standing frustration over what many female soccer players around the globe consider a pervasive culture of harassment, unwanted advances, and tolerated misogyny in the sport. I truly believe that the world is really coming to grips with the misogyny and the sexism that has been rampant in soccer, whether it's Spain or any other, so many other countries, and they're saying enough is enough. And FIFA saying Rubiales' suspension is an initial period of 90 days pending the disciplinary proceedings opened against him. After a now-deleted social media post accusing Hermoso of lying, Spain's soccer governing body is holding an emergency meeting later today to discuss any further action against Rubiales. And guys, protesters already gathering outside their offices. Mm, all right. Thank you, Ariel. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.